This is the inaugural use of the Joe Tissery. This product is crazy. I personally never thought it would work. Uh, wouldn't necessarily believe that it would if I hadn't just used it to my, uh, myself. And uh, I've actually got two birds on here. This is round two. I've already taken one off. It was the test bird, just in case I was right and everything uh, went terribly. But everything went really, really well. And uh, let's, let's take it, up, take the lid open here and see what we've got in there. There's somebody else watching over there. So these guys just went on a few minutes ago. Uh, got some fizzy pig Jamaican firewalk on there. Really looking forward to this one. Three fifty is just about a perfect temperature, uh, based on based on the uh, last bird. Hopefully, this one will go the same, and uh, we'll update you in a few minutes. Actually, about an hour when we get closer to done. Get some pretty color on there, and maybe we'll even show you pictures of us eating it. Make you jealous. All right, quick update on the inaugural Jotisserie cook. Got two birds on here going steady about, uh, temperature's reading about 340 right now. Let's take a look. A little bit of smoke coming out, not too much. Nothing to be concerned about. I think we're progressing nicely. It's like my uh, my tines may have come a little bit loose. Might need to adjust those in a minute. But boy, that color is looking spot on. I think uh, maybe another half hour and we'll be good to go. Check back with you then. All right, we are back for our final installment of the inaugural. Jotisserie cook. I'm running out of daylight here, so it's probably a little bit premature, maybe about 20 minutes, but we're just about all the way there. And uh, what I really want to show you is, is the color on these birds. Uh, they, are, they are pretty glorious. Again, uh, if I can get a little focus here. There we go. Well, sort of. There we go. Sitting still at about 350, rock solid. Not sure if the camera's getting that or not, but that is supermarket quality pretty rotisserie bird right there. Courtesy of the Kamado Joe Jotisserie. Honestly, never thought it'd work. Works incredibly well. So pleased about that. Way to go, Kamado Joe. Got another winner here. Thanks everybody. We're gonna shut this down. If I remember when I'm eating, I'll snap a couple pictures. Try and make y'all jealous. All right, we're back in the kitchen here at Fireside Outdoor Kitchens. This is where the magic happens. And uh, right here we are looking at some of that magic. We've got three birds here, all cooked on the Kamado Joe using the Joe Tisserie. First time we've used this. this. Let's go back over here. This is the first one I did. I did this one as a sacrifice. I figured it would get burned up. It did not. It ended up glorious. So excited about this. And these guys. Perfect. Looks, uh, looks supermarket perfect for a rotisserie bird. Uh, very impressed with how the jotisserie did. And uh, we're going to leave it at this. I'm going to go carve these up. And I'm going to eat them and enjoy them because I know they're going to be awesome. Kamado Joe Jotisserie. First time, look at these results. That's solid stuff right there.